Hi Leo, welcome to your reading and this is for Leo Ascendant. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus placement in their chart. Jupiter may resonate with the reading. Cross watchers are always welcome. Cross watchers, if I described someone and you know that it is not you, it is not you. Just because you are connecting with Leo, you're gonna assume that whom I'm describing here is you. Please don't, this is not a personal reading. For those of you who's new to the channel, welcome. You might want to consider subscribing for I am always hosting a party online wherein I am doing a live streaming. And in the live stream, you can ask me questions. If you miss the live streaming, you can still ask me questions. There is a link in the description box. Click that link, you'll be routed to my page type in your questions and then click submit so leo if you are into twin flame readings almost personal readings pick a card and channel messages you can subscribe to the other channel that is timeless tarot 111 you may resonate with the entire reading you may resonate with some bits and pieces of the reading take it as you will take what only resonates would really appreciate if you can click the subscribe button and smash that like button so that the video can ride onto the youtube algorithm so leo i can sense here that things are already moving I know, Leo, it's been really hard this past few days, weeks, or months. It felt that your person here is very stubborn, but you stretch your patience. It felt like to me, you may be in a situation of no movement really stubborn here and I can sense now let's say there is still a little resistance still right at this very moment but their stubbornness because I can feel here that they are holding back from a lot of um, fear so I can sense right now here, Leo, that they're going to, a, a sudden change that they are just throwing, you know, when, when you are, when you cannot help it, if you want to, let's say you are in a deserted um, island, but you don't know how to swim. But you want to go to another island. There is really an urge for you to be on the other island. But then again, kind of like you are just going to jump off and just float, right? It doesn't matter if there is a shark, you know, under... Um, yeah, under the, 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 the ocean. It doesn't matter now if they are drowning. Their goal is just to get to be, you know, taking the risk. Their goal is just to be on the other island. So they cannot help the emotion now. No matter how hard they try to resist, no matter how self-talk that they have inside their head. No, I'm not in love with Leo. I am sorry. The more that they deny it, the more that they are feeling it. This is more of, okay, I can't do anything with my feelings. So what I'm going to do here is to jump off. And... It doesn't matter if I'll get busted. It doesn't matter if I'll be, you know, if I'm going to die as long as I 
really need to be in the other island. See, the contract is already here. The contract is already um, on your way with the Wheel of Fortune. Now, something that you are not expecting, but here they are. Probably they will be in your life with a little madness, you know. They don't want to do it, but there's no way. Example, when you were a kid, you were given a task by your parents. Let's say, do your homework. No mom, no dad, I still want to play. Do it now or, you know, you're going to go to your room. You don't want to do it, but you have no choice. So you're doing things, but it is somehow against your will. And, you know, you're throwing tantrums, you're shouting. So this is some sort of it. I know you're not the one who's giving them commands, but it's the universe. How can you? You're just human. How can you fight against the universe, right? So they might be still in your life, you know, treating you a little cold, badly, but they're doing it because there's no way for them not to do it. See, they may be a little standoffish, a little rough, mm, a little rough, a little rough with you, but they are giving you the equal give and take it may not be verbal though I can sense here through action Queen of Swords action they're doing it kind of like they are under a spell they're already tired of fighting these feelings over they can't I told you no matter how hard they've tried to fight this urge of not um, giving you the commitment is kind of like they are fighting with themselves as well. It is the universe. It is the universe is actually making a decision, not them. This is a good thing. They, they're going to have a hard time though. But well then, it's not your problem anymore. Because your victory is here. The hardships will be on themselves. I'm going to say the, um, the signs you might be connecting with. Their sun signs or they have a placement of this of these signs in their chart or you might have um, a placement of this in this in your chart Taurus Sagittarius Leo might be connecting with your own sign um, I am seeing a lot of air sign on this and Earth's sign. So this is your reading. If you resonate with this and you want to go in depth, you can book a personal reading with me. If you are okay with the reading and you just have a question or two, there is a link in the description box. Click that link. You'll be routed to my page. Type in your questions and then click submit. 500 likes for this video and your next video will be a full reading. Thank you so much for watching. Love and light to you. Namaste. See you on the next reading. Goodbye, Leo.